Come on, come on, vacuum if you switch off, switch on, please. No, no. Switch on, please, switch on, please. Okay, da, da. Leave it, leave it, I need to vacuum. No, Reza. Switch on. I, I need to vacuum the house. Switch on, please. Okay, leave it alone, leave it alone. Leave it alone! Not funny eh? Okay, so today I am cooking and I'm doing batch cooking. Batch cooking means you cook a lot and then you pack them up, um, put inside the freezer to freeze so that your food lasts longer and then you know you don't have to cook often so today I'm cooking chicken soup for Reza because he can eat rice already and then chicken curry for us and there's only three of us in the household so this is actually a lot of cooking so what um, as I mentioned I will cook a lot and then I will put them uh, I will pack them and then put them in the freezer or the chiller depending on how fast or how soon you want to um, eat your meals so this is what happens after we are done cooking um, this is what so Fauzi has actually free some corn so he took the corns and then he will put them inside the plastic bag and then vacuum seal them uh, so they last longer and then this is uh, ayam lemak chili padi and this is chicken curry from the last batch cooking that is still here so you know um, that way I don't have to like cook every day and I also don't like to um, you know like buy fresh food or fresh produce and then put them inside the fridge and then don't use them so normally like when I go to the market I'll just like buy and then like cook everything put them inside the freezer and that way my fridge will look so um, neat and organized uh, so as you can see I don't keep uh, fresh produce very long so this is uh, some of the food that Fauzi has cooked and he also does batch cooking so this was two bags of pasta so that's a lot of pasta and then we eat some of them and the rest we just freeze so this is beef pasta and then there's spicy fried rice and he even put the date on it so that we know um, when it was cooked um, and then here he also um, put fried rice paste um, so he prepares them um, in bulk then uh, when he wants to cook fried rice then he just take one of this and then um, cook it and then uh, put them inside bags like this yeah so this is one of the ways that we can save time so the other thing that Fauzi is doing is um, his attempt to grow spring onion I don't know what this is and this one I don't know what this is but this he say He's trying to grow spring onion because apparently the spring onion will grow from the top of this onion here. Then, um, yeah, that's what he wants. Today is a quite a productive day for me. I did some housework. Um, usually, I don't do housework. I don't like doing housework. We have a we can help her for that. So she comes in every week and helps us um, tidy up the house, vacuum, mop. Um, wash the toilet, iron my clothes yes, I am very lazy when it comes to housework I just don't like doing them if I do have one housework that I like doing it's probably vacuuming yeah, but other than that <laughs> no yeah, so um, because of the circuit breaker so she can't come to clean up our house now so we have to do it ourselves and because of that I'm actually very grateful that I'm living in a three room flat so um, housework like vacuum and mopping like that is 
much more manageable <laughs> when your house is small. So I'm really grateful. Like, Alhamdulillah, my house is small. But having said that, um, I did housework also just to feel productive at home because otherwise it can get um, really restless and boring. So I actually enjoyed doing the housework even though um, uh, I only did vacuuming and mopping the house today and Fauzi is supposed to clean the toilets and um, he helps with the laundry and then I have to iron the laundry. I just hate ironing. Speaking of which, of vacuuming, I am in the market for a robot vacuum. I think it's time for me to invest in a robot vacuum. So if you know any uh, brands or robot vacuums that you have used and they are like really good uh, please let me know because um, I'm totally gonna buy it uh, initially uh, when it first came out right I didn't think that I need a robot vacuum because like I said I have a weekend helper and um, Reza wasn't born yet <laughs> at the time so um, and it was really expensive when it came out in the market but now um, it seems to be quite affordable my mom just recently bought one and i was really impressed because she says that you know she doesn't have to vacuum anymore and the carpets are all quite clean i mean the suction is has been quite good so um now that reza is you know he's picking up everything on the floor and putting it in his mouth <laughs> and like i have to like constantly sweep and vacuum and mop the house make sure that it's really clean so that he doesn't do that and I think I'm just gonna go ahead and invest in a robot vacuum. Um, I know that there are the pricey range and then there's the more affordable range. I don't know um, what's a good benchmark, uh, like what's, what's good. So just let me know if you used any and like you really love your robot vacuum and like I must, must have it uh, because I'm totally in the market for one. Um, probably not be able to go and shop for it maybe i have to do some research and buy it online i guess because of the circuit breaker but yeah i guess uh yeah we all have to do online now thank you for watching this video and uh see you in the next video stay safe stay home bye bye